Hello and welcome to Sentinel's Reprieve's guide for making money as a new player in Star Citizen doing bunker missions, helping you on your way to earn AUEC to buy that shipping game that you've been drooling over. Now, the great thing about bunker missions is that you can do this in any ship. The ship's only purpose is a means of transport to the mission, which is a first person shooter mission. This is a great type of mission for anyone wanting to earn money early doors and also gear up with plenty of loot such as weapons and armour. So before we look at the contract tab and head out to the mission, let's take a look at what would be beneficial to take with you. To start with, we don't need anything special as like I said, it's possible to loot all we need for future runs from the mission itself. We want some basic armour, a gun and some ammo for it. We also need a means to heal ourselves if we get hurt, such as a med pen or a medical device with some spare charges. I like to take a backpack with me as well, so I've got extra space in my inventory to carry things. And I also think it's really useful to take a multi-tool with the tracked beam attachment, which can be used for moving the loot and bodies around. When you're ready, you're gonna to wanna to jump in your ship and head over to a planet. I've picked Hurston and I'll continue to do missions around there as you build up reputation which will then offer you better paying missions. But you can pick whatever planet you like and don't forget to set your respawn point somewhere nearby. As of course accidents and 30ks will happen. But the good thing about this is if your game does crash or you die you don't lose anything and you can just start again. So when you arrive near the planet that you've picked, you're going to want to open up the contract tab. I'm going to move to a blank space because otherwise you can't see it quite so well. Hit F1 and open your Moby Glass. Go to the contract section, go down to mercenary and before you start also select a call to arms. This will give you 500 AUEC for every person that you kill. Now this is the first time I've done a bunker around Hurston so it gives you the option to do the security contract evaluation which is basically your first bunker mission that you're going to do once you've done this it will then open up other bunker missions that you can do once you've done this make sure you hit track and your marker should appear on screen for where you're heading hover over the marker hit quantum and travel to the location when you come at quantum free fly towards your marker when you get closer to the bunker, you'll notice that some turrets come on scan. These won't engage you because you are assisting the security that's already there, so they've given you a free pass to enter the site and help them. Be aware for future that some bunker missions are completely overrun by the hostiles and the turrets will shoot you. So you'll have to park your ship out of turret range and then use a wheeled vehicle to get you closer. So before you accept the contracts, make sure you read it thoroughly, just so that you know which type it is. Once you've landed, power down your ship, get out, and head towards the bunker. You won't have any hostiles on the surface, it's only when you catch the lift to the bottom that you need to be ready to engage. And if you look at the top, you can see it tells you how many hostiles are remaining. Already the security have killed one of the enemies. That's one less that you've got to look out for, but unfortunately you won't get the quarter arm bounties for those kills. So you can see on screen now a few little triangles. They denote friendly, so they are not to be killed. But be careful because sometimes the triangles don't always work and you want to make sure you're killing the right person. As the ship can hit the fan if a stray bullet hits one of the security people. As you can see at the top of the screen I'm getting awarded 500 AUEC for every person I killed which adds up a little bit as well. And all you have to do is move around the bunker and make sure you kill all of the hostiles. I've got one hostile remaining. But the security team took him out for me, so that's mission complete. I'm going to get my money and now it's time to loot. Now you notice that it has leave area or you will be trespassing. You basically have 15 minutes to loot up and get your ship out of here before those turrets will start shooting your ship. When you're looting bodies, don't forget that you can open the chest pieces and leg pieces and they can also contain items in them as well. Keep your eye out for any red loot boxes like this one. 
they're going to contain decent gear like sniper rifles, rare armor sets and attachments for your guns. One of the best ways to loot the bodies that I've found is to simply tractor beam the bodies onto the lift and then into your ship. Once you've left the area you can simply loot the bodies for what you want and then discard them out the back. So let's have a little look at my Moby Glass to see what the next mission could be. I go to my contracts tab, mercenary and there I have assist in defending site. So there's my next bunker mission for me to do quite simply rinse and repeat well thanks for watching i hope you found this useful if you did please don't forget to like and subscribe and i will catch you in the next one